Hi everybody, welcome. It's Michelle here at the Angels Toolbox with your weekly Archangel Michael Sword and Shield Oracle reading for the week ahead, Monday the 13th of July through to Sunday the 19th of July. This week on Thursday the 16th we have a new moon, so it's a great time to make your new moon wishes. Here we go. Let's have a look at three cards, one for the start of the week, one for the middle of the week and one for the weekend and we'll shuffle the cards calling in our angels just like we would with an ordinary oracle and here we go the start of the week Archangel Michael is talking about house protection your home is your castle Archangel Michael and his band of angels stand guard over your home day and night We'll flip the card and we'll read a little more. This shield card is symbolically presented to you by Archangel Michael as a powerful tool of protection. Archangel Michael has heard your request to be in and around your home to protect yourself, loved ones and pets. Archangel Michael loves invitations to stand outside your home, especially at night and also when you're absent. Visualise Archangel Michael standing at your front door and an angel at every external door and window and then fall asleep safe and sound. Angels are naturally attracted to places of beauty and love, so it is important to maintain a high energy within your home by regularly cleansing. Archangel Michael resonates with either the vibration of sound, such as a singing bowl or tingers, or the vibrations of aroma such as sage. Sage is a herb that is considered sacred by the Native American Indians and Archangel Michael connects with this aroma to quickly clear negative and dense energies within your home or any space such as an office, business or even your car. Regular purification of the atmosphere in your home keeps the energies at a high vibration. Maintaining the vibration of love within the home is also assisted by having angel altars, angel figurines and other items symbolically representing angels such as angel wings. So there we are, Archangel Michael at the start of the week is very much in and around the home. The middle of the week, oh we've had this card the other day as well, chimney sweep, financial assistance. Archangel Michael requests that you allow him to chimney sweep your worries, anxieties and fears about money. So this is another card talking about cleansing the home. So if there's financial issues within the home, this is a, another card that's signifying the need to clear that house. He will replace all these worries with the rich emotions associated with abundance. Financial pressures are about to ease. What a lovely card. I think one of my favourites. This is a sword and shield card and it's presented to you by Archangel Michael as a powerful tool for stress relief. Archangel Michael steps in to provide guidance and assistance regarding your financial affairs. It is time to surrender your concerns about money to the divine care and love of the heavenly realm. Prosperity or lack of it is an outer expression of ideas in your head. Prosperity begins with feeling good about yourself. When you believe that anything is possible, you open yourself up to solutions and answers in every area of your life. It is time for a spring clean of your affairs. Archangel Michael will send people and guidance that will assist you with your bookkeeping, savings, taxation, business or anything related to your personal debt. You may be guided to a new bank, to cancel a credit card or to change your spending habits. He will also guide you to change your long scripted belief systems regarding money. Money is purely and simply an energy, a universal unlimited source that arrives from expected and unexpected sources. Archangel Michael assists you now to tap into this God-given source. So there we are, another card about cleansing and very much focused midweek after we cleanse the house to start cleansing our beliefs and our worries also about our finances. And with that new moon coming in on Thursday, perfect time to really have a look at any way that you can cleanse those 
thought processes or give over your worries about money to Archangel Michael. And the weekend, the positivity card, the energy of words. Archangel Michael requests a personal thorough review of your inner mind and outer verbal dialogue. So another card about cleaning out the clutter, whether it's physical, emotional or words now. Words have a powerful energy. Use them wisely. The sword and shield is symbolically presented to you by Archangel Michael as a powerful tool for stress relief. Each and every day you speak thousands of words without thinking about the powerful energy they contain or deliver. Just a few words together have the power to heal and the power to hurt. For example, I love you or I hate you. Such a vibrational difference. Archangel Michael asks that you notice your inner dialogue also. The words that are played over and over in your mind. Are these words positive and encouraging or do they consist of constant self-criticism that depletes your self-worth and value? If you notice negative thoughts, just say, Archangel Michael, override and correct. No further self-punishment is required. Archangel Michael also asks you to observe your descriptive language, especially words or phrases that you repeat frequently and also negative body talk. For example, I have a broken heart or it was gut-wrenching. They're just a couple of examples. Such language can have a detrimental effect on your physical body and energy fields. Focus on positive words and affirmations of love and encouragement. An affirmation is a beginning point to change. Choose positive sentences that will either eliminate something from your life or help you create something new and beautiful in your life. Archangel Michael will assist you to focus on words of high energy to improve your self-worth, self-esteem and personal relationships. Archangel Michael also suggests that you bless everyone that you meet. So there we go. This week we have the perfect time to do a cleanse of the home, Hand over your financial worries, especially with the new moon coming. Put your wishes out there. So shift the focus from what you're worried about financially to focusing on what you would like to manifest. So you step up into a different vibration, a more positive vibration. And then on the weekend, really focusing on working on your affirmations, working on your words that come out of your mouth and what you're thinking about. So I wish you a very beautiful week ahead and I look forward to seeing you back here next week for another beautiful Archangel Michael Sword and Shield reading at the Angel's Toolbox. Bye.